Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video. Welcome to the Bitcoin family YouTube channel where you buy Bitcoins and you say bye to the banks. Guys, short TA update on this amazing Friday, the 21st of September, because I have a busy day. But let's quickly jump into the charts. First chart, we have a beautiful chart on the Aurox platform. Um, this is the four hour chart, just checking how Bitcoin is doing. Um, we are still in this downward channel. We need to break this um, top line over here and then break this high. So we need to come above 48,700 to break the complete channel in my opinion and if we want to break that channel then always we will move like this we go break out we will retest and then we will go up in my opinion now the thing is that it is very difficult because we see this 200 moving average on the four hour that we are walking into that is the resistance that one is now at the level of 45,600 so we can still move up but there is the important part. Are we going to break that one or are we going to fall down even lower to that 37k level that everybody is expecting? Like I said yesterday, um, in my opinion, if you look at the Elliott wave corrections, you should have, this is like A, B, C, we should be finished. So let's see a other chart if we can see if anything more. Sorry for all the noise guys, there is a lot of construction going on here in Portugal. A lot of lines downward channel that we just showed you this huge yellow line is that trend line that came all the way from the top you know that I talked about a few times we need to break that one over here to become bullish and when we broke that one we went up and we retested and we became bullish now we retested that line again and we went up again but if we zoom in a little bit on the day chart then we see a few lines this one, the bottom here, this is the 100 day moving average. Yeah, there's a lot of noise. I hope the noise is not too uh, much influencing the sound. But this is the 100 moving average. The red line here, I will click them so you can see it. This one as well, because it's out 100 moving average. The red line on top here, over there, is the 200 moving average. And the green line is the 20 moving average. So. These two there are coming together. That's a lot of resistance in this area between 45,000 and 46,300. Here is the support. So yes, it is completely possible that we run into that resistance, come down again and go up again something. We need to break the channel. We need to create a new high. Very exciting times for Bitcoin. Bam, this chart shows you a little bit more zoomed out uh, version. Um, blue is the copy of 2013. Yellow is the copy of 2017. Um, if I put yellow on it over here, you can see that we are moving exactly in an average way of these two moves. We are not following the yellow part, not completely following the, the blue part, but a little bit in between. The blue part shows us over here that we could drop and this week, the 27th of September, even to 38K. So that is in line with what I showed you in the previous. I think somebody is mad on one of the workers over there on the previous um, uh, charts. The yellow one tells us if we would copy the 2071, nah, we will still go, this is based from July on. Um, we will stay a little bit in this area and then go up. So if we move in between, we could see a drop, but maybe not till 38k. I wouldn't bet on that drop, guys. Now, let's um, zoom out a little bit more, because this is more important to understand for you guys. That is the BAM over here, this chart. This is where it all um, comes to, guys. We can freak out on every minute candle, every 5 minute, every 30 minute candle on the chart, or we um, zoom out and look at the bigger picture. Look at this chart. This chart has a blue line and a green line. The blue line is 2016 till 2020. The green line is 2020 till 2024. Um, 
we can see it is all about the return after the halving per epoch and this is the amount of days after the halving so we can see that after this amount of days here like there 521 days there was almost a 3000 percent profit in bitcoin now if we look at the green one at the moment we are here at 400 what will we be for let's say 470 days we didn't even reach like 400 percent in total profit i am missing this huge run here this one and that is i think that we are going to do uh, maybe a little bit later than the previous runs and now we are at 470 days so let's see three months another 100 days maybe we will go to the top here at 570 days or maybe a little bit later over there but we still need to have that blow off top is in the total returns of the halving per uh, per for your year cycle that is what i need to say guys that was everything for today yes it is friday so be aware the weekend is always a little bit more volatile um, and if you don't know how to trade all of the stuff that you uh, we just talked about then maybe take a look guys at for example bam over here bam over here then maybe you should take a look at the bam bam indicator um, because that one is helping you a lot if you look here and we turn on the bam bam indicator then you um, know when to long when to short the market it's an indicator that will help you uh, longing or shorting now we're seeing this short flag here on the top this is in line with all the stuff that i just uh, talked about so if we get a short we could short to the middle of this area over here find support if we break that one we could even go lower guys uh, not freaking out but zooming out because again it's not about this one it is all about the bigger pictures and the bigger pictures we need to go to that top line over there and the top line is now around 140k now that was really everything for today guys and i hope you really enjoyed this very noisy short ta update if you did enjoy it give the view a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and leave a comment what do you think about these charts thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again bam